Hello, my name is Dr. Claudia Chiuchini. I'm a staff scientist in R&D with molecular biology at Thermo Fisher Scientific. We are here to introduce a white paper titled Utilizing both homology and oligonucleotide stitching techniques to build large constructs. Building DNA constructs that are large in nature and contain no extraneous sequences is often the cornerstone of synthetic biology. One of the key engineering tools in constructing such DNA is Gibson assembly cloning, and we will discuss how the gene art Gibson assembly hi-fi cloning technology can be used to build large constructs. There are two approaches, using fragment homology and the use of stitching oligonucleotides to create seamless constructs. Adjacent fragments share a 30 base pair overlap as shown here. The resulting 11 KB covalently bonded plasmid was transformed via electroporation into in vitro gen Electromax DH10B competent cells. Recombinant clones were selected on LB agar plates containing ampicillin, and PCR analysis was performed using custom primers to amplify 500 base pair transition regions between fragments 1 and 2 and fragments 3 and 4. To assess the cloning efficiency, Reactions were performed in triplicate, and the efficiency corresponds to the ratio between full-length clones and analyzed clones, and is expressed as a percentage, as shown. Stitching oligonucleotides work as a bridge between the DNA fragments to be joined, and share half of the sequence with each fragment. One fragment and two fragment cloning require two and three stitching oligonucleotides, respectively, as shown. The overall cloning efficiency obtained from one and two fragment cloning using different oligonucleotide concentrations is also shown here. We determined the optimum concentration to be somewhere between 30 and 45 nanomolar. This white paper explores the use of two strategies for building constructs with Gene Art Gibson Assembly Hi-Fi cloning technology. Using complementary homology and also the use of stitching oligonucleotides which offers maximum flexibility for cloning of PCR applicants, de novo synthesized fragments, and restriction fragments in any desired vector. If you would like to learn more about this topic, please visit thermofisha.com slash Gibson Assembly.